Hey YouTube, we're here with the ASW28. Just wanted to show you this little stand I made. Um, it works really nice because this plane is so obnoxiously long, even when it's stored. Just took a couple of sticks, ran them into this foam block. It took me like three minutes to make it, and then I took the plane and stuck it in. And I made some labels so I know which direction to put stuff. And then I also took these foam pieces and cut slots in them so that I can keep the wings separated so that the control horns stop gouging each other. Uh, but I wanted to show you how that works. And then it just balances, provided you don't have the battery in there. Um, and then the other thing I want to show you guys is I'm going to be trying my video instead of going on the 4S that I've been doing 4S 2260C Zippy Compact. I'm going to be going back to the 60C 2200 milliamp 3S um, Turn G Heavy Duty um, voltage detector. This is a Volantix RC stock uh, folding crop just with my embellishments for color. I want to show you the difference. Come take a look at this. I got a 12.8 prop from E-Flight. Fits perfectly. The only thing I did, just like I said, the embellishments to like paint it white. I had to tighten my screws in a little bit more so they don't hit when it spins. And I'll show you the package for that. Um, again, this is the OEM part. I had chipped one little tip off, so I had to shorten the prop a little bit. So this is the 12-8 uh, 12 fold, 12 folding prop. And it's uh, EFL... EFLP glare there. 120 80pp plastic folding prop this was like five bucks and that's a very good value because I also got this for about six bucks but it looks cheap um, it's a master air screw but it does have the spinner mechanism and all that stuff same size but I don't think it would have the propensity to want to wrap around the fuse like this does um, and they're a little sticky because I haven't flown with it yet um, was that one black and you painted it white too yeah, these were black when I got them. And just I in case one. somebody's looking online. So when you get them, uh, just get them on HorizonHobby.com. And they work really nice. They're a drop-in fit. I couldn't believe it. I thought I was going to have to modify them to fit, but they fit perfect. So evidently, there's something standard about this size on that spinner. So without further ado, we're going to go out and get a video real quick. Uh, flying. And it's not snowing right now, but it was snowing earlier. So hopefully we'll get uh, decent little weather for this flight. Okay. Okay, guys, we're outside. Get lights. Uh, just show you the prop. It should be working okay, so we're going to go ahead and give it a shot here. Take off flaps are on. Got a little bit of headwind coming from this direction. guys so it just it doesn't fly near as heavy that's my landing flap configuration get into the power here we might go behind the house here okay show you guys a roll here boy that thing is just rolling really good i adjusted my controls my control horns a little bit so they're all on the outside pole basically now. Well, that thing blends in, doesn't it? Yep. First click of flaps there. Just look at that thing gliding the wind. I'm like barely moving. See it on? Mm hmm. That's my takeoff flaps there. It's so still. It's awesome. I can definitely tell you that on the 3S. It's definitely more doggy than with the 4S, even with the big prop, which is to be expected because we're really pulling a lot of power price through that thing. Just, uh, kind of flies a lot more like a glider should right now, though, just because of the wind. We didn't have this nice steady wind the last time we filmed the video. But those lights look sweet. I'm really happy with the way they turned out. Real easy to see. Let's watch the crow. There's crow, out of the crow. Well, it just sets it to, just sets it down. It's gonna be easy to land if I can go into the wind like this. Let's watch some rolls. 
Gotta get a little quicker, mix a little rudder in to get my rolls snappier. Especially with the crosswind, I shouldn't be doing rolls into a crosswind like that. That was kind of stupid. Sounds like I'm really pulling a lot more juice when I kick that, that prop on there, guys. We'll come down here. Let's get down a little further. See if we can... Uh, I'm kind of curious if I can get a roll here, just out of gravity. Yeah, probably a little too low right now. Not quite enough headwind. It's got the pulling power that I was hoping for now. It's the get out of trouble power that I was wanting. Okay, here we go. So we'll do a roll now. That was just ailerons. I love that sound. It's so cool. Very good rudder authority now. Really good rudder authority. I'm going to do a flip here. Come into a stall turn. The other thing is, guys, on this 3S configuration, I'm going to notice those white lights should dim. They should dim when I'm running out of battery, in addition to my beeping. Turn on my takeoff flash to see if we can ride this wind a little bit. Gosh, that thing is so easy to fly. It's... Earlier I was flying those other planes and they were just all over the place. This thing is just rock solid in this wind. Are you going to switch to that and try it? I don't know if I'm going to switch to it right now just because our limited time frame. Okay. That's what I was going to say. You want to try to take a landing here? I got six and a half minutes left, but just because of timing reasons, I try to take a landing. Yeah. Where are you going to try and land? I'm going to come into the wind over this house and go down into this patch here in the Okay. Landing flaps engaged. We're just going to try it once. We'll see how it goes. No pro yet, guys. We're not even needing pro right now. There is quite a bit of I might try to throw it in a little more. Pull any flaps, bubble it out, kick off the throw, kick off the throw, bubble it on and on. Off. Okay. Do that. do that near vertical pull out, it's like not even an issue from a stall point. Okay. Let's 
try this for you. Might be a little easier today with that heavy wind. Okay. You ready to go up there? Yep, I'll follow okay, you. Cool. Take off flaps are on, just keep you in the air a little bit better. Can I help you with the traffic and stuff on Yep. You can also go through the yard here. I just don't want to hit those lights. Yeah. Crystal lights. Janet's leaving. Yeah. They're going away from us. They are? Yep. Oh, and she's going right now. Okay. How about this car, you know? I can't tell. I think they're watching you. You're clear. Yep, you're clear. Nope, you're good. Yeah, that was pretty good. Hey guys, honestly, the worst part of flying in the snow is now I gotta wipe off the bottom of the wing. That was good. And uh, I'm sure I'm pretty cold, so my wife's hands that are yep. not protected. Are very cold. Also very cold. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.